Great to have you join me for a video devotional today. Our title is Let God Write Your Resume, looking at David and Goliath. In 1 Samuel 17, verse 36, it states, Your servant has struck down both lions and bears, and this uncircumcised Philistine shall be like one of them, for he has defied the armies of the living God. In the story of David versus Goliath, there's a moment at which David must convince King Saul to let him go and fight the giant. David has grown offended by the taunts and jeers of the Philistine Goliath toward the armies of the living God. He asks, what will be done for the man who was willing to go and fight and kill him? Word gets back to Saul, and although David is willing to fight, the king has his doubts. David is just a youth. What experience does he have? But in his response, David goes through his list of accomplishments on the field. Lions and bears have fallen by his hand, and Goliath would be no different. When we allow God to bring us through smaller, more minor battles, we find that we are prepared for the bigger things to come. We must trust that in this process, he is building and writing our resume. God knew that one day Goliath would confront Israel. And he knew David would be the man to take him down. All the years fighting bears and lions were preparation years for David to get ready. David may not even known why those smaller battles occurred, but once Goliath appeared, he knew how to fight and win. May we let God write our resume as well so that when we face Goliath, we take the same posture. And saying as David did in 1 Samuel 17, 47, The battle is the Lord's, and he will give you Goliath into our hand. Question to ask today, am I able to see God writing the resume of my life, knowing smaller battles in hidden years are preparing me for what is to come and for the journey ahead? Can I trust God in the smaller things as well as the larger ones to come? Lord, just as you were preparing David in his youth, you prepare us. Our spiritual growth in you means that we can face and conquer giants because you give us the ability to do it. I hope that's a promise that you take with you today. Be encouraged. Be blessed.